So it's been a minute and I thought it was going to be cold out here because I brought my sweatshirt. So we're just going to do a cold start and then we're going to scrape off. We're going to scrape off some tint and then just for fun, we're going to use Just because we want to, just because out of curiosity, I want to see if it actually works. But there's really no helping any of these cracks at all. So let's get this start. First, get that reset. That's not sounding good. Come on. There it is. And she's running. Nice and warm out. Doesn't need to warm up that quick at all. We're not going anywhere, Bubba. Okay, you can sit there. Surprised this tent doesn't just fall off. It's so old. I mean, it's. I had. To, yeah, I can't remember when I had it put on, to be honest. Ooh, she's knocking. Maybe that's not a. Maybe that's ex maybe loose exhaust, maybe a knot. Probably not. Could be loose exhaust, but either way, um, let it warm up for a minute or two. And I'm gonna go ahead and work on some more of this tint here. Because I'm gonna get the two side the doors off. I'm gonna go ahead and leave the front piece on in the back. Um, no use in taking those off at the moment. They uh, they're still in good shape. But I'll leave those two on, and uh, because the sides are messed up, I'm just going to take those off, and then we'll be back in a second. So one side down, one side to go. We got to get this side done over here. Um, not sure how well that's going to work out uh, because that's got a lot of tint to remove there. And we got a lot of uh, flat dead razor blade, the straight razor that I don't have any more of. Nope. Hey, Gizmo, look who's here. Well, as soon as, uh, as soon as the battery charges up here in a second, we're gonna try to run this thing and uh, reset the idle so that it's not uh, trying to uh, run down the interstate at uh, 75 miles an hour while it's parked. And then we're gonna try to make sure the uh, timing is set because we set everything while it was cold. Now, obviously the weather has changed and the windows are clean now too so we 
get onto that in a second. Little steps at a time. So, yeah, at least now you can see out the windows when you're not driving the car on the sides. I mean, the windshield nobody really cares about. You don't, they don't use that these days anyway. They hardly use the rear view mirrors or turn signals, am I right? So, we'll play with the cracks in the front with that stuff in there. Probably just see if I could crack it more just for the heck of it. I don't see why not. So, but I don't see it working. So, I could probably still get new glass for this car anyway. Um, looked it up, Rock Auto, and has it. So, we'll see what we can find. Let me give this a minute to charge the battery up and see if we can get it running. And uh, we'll go from there. Okay, so we're going to try to film, film, fill in this big old plumber's crack right here because we get tired of seeing it. Although, there's no promises that anything's going to happen. The directions say, let's not lose my parts. I already lost some. They say use suction cups, resin applicator, and all that stuff for fractures. Yep, yep. And let's see. For long hair cracks. Yep. We're going to apply very slowly dispense resin along the crack. And then we're going to put these little sheets over it. Let it sit there, and then we're going to see what happens, and then we're going to do some things, and it's going to do some things, and we're going to see if it works, and if it doesn't, we're going to be like, well, whatever, and if it does, we're going to be like, well, whatever, because the whole windshield's got cracks all over the place. So this is just for fun. It really doesn't matter if it works or not. So here goes. 
Alright, so we're going to fill the fry. Please try to. All right, well, as you can see, the crack didn't go away. The stuff didn't work on my application, obviously. But, you know, that crack was, I didn't really expect anything, any miracles anyway. This windshield's cracked so bad. There ain't nothing fixing it except for a new windshield. So I've seen it work. It's worked on other cars, but um, I was just trying it for fun. But we did get the timing adjusted and we did get the um, RPM, the RPMs lower proper where they're supposed to be now. So it's not idling so high and it starts up a lot better. So yeah, this is a late later video because I realized I forgot to tell y'all about that because my daughter came outside and she wanted to play some soccer because they didn't have practice today and they don't have a game tomorrow. So uh tonight this is my outro i will i'm gonna go over here and see if i can get the horse's attention so i threw some apples out there for him and i will talk to you all later see you